Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Jurassic Park, the game where things are getting pretty bad. We started episode 2, there's obviously some sort of dinosaur hunting us down that we don't really know about, we haven't properly seen it yet, and then we're back with these guys. the visitor center. You have no idea what you're getting into out here. I know my way. I just need you to keep us safe from these creatures. Easier said than done. How am I supposed to do that? Electric fences are down, dinosaurs have free run of the island. None of us are safe here. Do you understand that? This is InGen Rescue Team Alpha trying to reach Dr. Jerry Harding. Obviously, the visitor center was compromised. If you're still out there, we're trying to... Dad, if there's a rescue team hmm. coming, maybe we should try to leave a trail for them or something. Jess, that's enough. If we want to keep out of the way of dangerous predators, I'm going to need to know where we're headed. Norte. North? To the coast? What for? Don't worry about it. Is the boat still there? Is that what she's counting on? I doubt it's going to be there anymore. Hopefully none of those creatures are here. You're hurt. Let me help you. Help me. All right, jeez. We're going to rest here for a minute. She's become very aggressive. If we're stopping, I'll need to make a fire. It'll keep the dinosaurs away. Will it? Stay where I can see you. Will it though? Also, we've seen the T-Rex. We haven't seen any raptors yet. It's bound to happen, isn't it? At some point Is in this game. Anything I can do? Stay close. I mean, if Raptor's sharp, we're pretty screwed. Is that blood on there? Is that blood on that rock? Looked a bit like it, didn't it? <coughs> okay, so. Uh, what have we got around here? Some sort of bushes. What's that? <gasps> Dad? Eggs. Some eggs over here. Any chance they could be dino eggs? Eggs? No. Remember, all the dinosaurs on the island are female? Still, just leave them alone. We have enough problems without an angry mama bird or lizard to deal with. <laughs> That's what you think. Right, can we have a look over That's here? A weird looking plant. Hey, don't wander off. I'm not, I'm just looking at some plants. More plants. Hey dad, are these berries edible? Probably not. It's best to steer clear of anything we find out here. Yeah, I would agree with that judgment. Uh, right, oh, it's, oh, wow, there's a lot of... This is a really big open area, it turns out. Um, what's this? Tracks. Dad, there are some fresh dino tracks here. They're small, like a chicken's. Uh, it's likely Compsognathus. I saw lots of them while we were walking. It's relatively harmless. It's nothing to worry about. Compies. Hopefully not. Are these berries edible? I'm hungry. That plant is poisonous. A handful of those berries is enough to kill a grown man. Damn. But they look delicious. Maybe just a couple wouldn't hurt me. Yes. <laughs> We're definitely not eating the berries, that is for sure. Um, right, can we talk to this lady then? Also, we can look at that, but let's talk to the lady. Back off some, okay? Apparently we're not talking to the lady. <laughs> can we look at this? What? What? Nothing. It's just looking at that. Maybe I can steal it. Uh, right, so... Oh, we can switch. Okay. Right. <coughs> Interesting. So, we can look. Well, that was helpful. <laughs> Alright, let's... So, she's got a gun. Is it loaded? Do we know it's loaded? Don't be stupid. I'm not really sure what else we can do here. What's this? Oh, we can talk to her. Okay. Let's ask about the wound. Normally I work with animals, but I am very well trained in first aid. I'd, I'd like to go ahead and take a look at your wound again, if you'll let me. I'm fine. Look, you're going to need it cleaned and dressed again to avoid infection. If you bring us back to the visitor center, I can get a hold of some antibiotics. We are not going back to the visitor center. Yeah? Some of these trees have fruits that look like tiny blueberries. Bring some to me. Uh, okay. It's Jess, by the way. What? Uh, Jess. My name's Jess. Okay, Jess. Bring me the berries. They're good medicine. Say please, maybe? <clears throat> right, um, why are you here? Look, before we go any further, I want to know why you're here and what you plan to do with us. You'll be okay if you do what I tell you. Thanks, that's really descriptive. Uh, do you have family? Do you have any family? None of your business. 
I just thought that if you could understand how... You love your daughter, don't you? Oh, uh, yes, of, of course. You'd do anything to make sure she grows up safe. Yeah, I would. Good. Then I know you'll do exactly as I say. And as long as you do that, I won't shoot her. Oh, good. Leverage. Oh, you talk to Jess. You, you have a daughter, don't you? Stop talking. Think of her, and you'll understand what I I'm... said. Shut up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I. You know nothing about me. We are not simpatico, comprende? You say another word, and I will shoot you and leave you can, for the scavengers. Can we take this? Please, just calm down. I didn't mean anything by it. Just shut up. Okay, okay, whoa. I won't, I promise. I will, don't hurt us. Just don't. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Yes, we got it. Nice. Please. Yoink. That's my walkie-talkie. Hey, um, I, I drank like four diet sodas earlier, and I really have to pee, like, super bad. Go. Hurry. We will. <clears throat> and we'll radio for help. Here we go. Weak, weak. Right, is that where we want to go? Hello? Can anyone hear me? Please identify yourself. Over. Hey, hi. Um, this is Jessica Harding. Me and my dad were supposed to have been rescued. There's this woman with a gun. I, I think she's taking us up north. Okay, can you describe your location? Any buildings, roads, Just landmarks? trees and stuff. Jungle. Uh, landmarks. Uh, no, not really. Just regular jungle crap, like trees and dirt and stuff. Everything looks the same out here. Oh, but my dad built a fire. You might be able to see the smoke if- Yo, what do you think you're doing? Radio in for help. Um, I'm <coughs> calling my boyfriend. Stupido. Please, this is my fault. I don't want to kill you, but I will do it in a heartbeat if I have to comprende. What I have to lose is too important. I wonder why though. Let's go. We're getting out of here. It's got to be the money, right? Also, I've been reading the Jurassic Park books. I'm about a third of the way through the first one. They're really, really good. So thank you to Thanos for recommending them. It didn't sound good down there. Girls said they were headed north. Let's head that way and see what we can find. But yeah, well worth a read if you like Jurassic Park and haven't read them. I read a study once that said, "Stop talking, just head north." Hang on to your butt. This is it. See anything, Oscar? Looks familiar. How's that exactly? Before your time. Yeah, hang on to your butts is the line that uh, Dr. Arnold uses before flipping the uh, the power, trying to flip the power back on, isn't it? Uh, right, wow, okay. At least we're not controlling the helicopter. That would be quite difficult. Ah, smoke. <coughs> smoke. Smoke? Think they're trying to signal us? I thought we were dealing with a hostage situation. Oh god, they're running from something. Oh! Uh, uh. Go, 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 go! Oh my god, why is it so complicated to engage the autopilot? <laughs> Move, 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 move. Uh, maybe. Oh god, okay. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. We died. Finally. Sorry, buddy. I'm gonna have to take over for a while. But why did that, like, the sort of little icon thing jammed there, which was a bit weird. So, like, that little keep it steady thing jammed. Oscar? Uh, gonna try. There we go, that time it worked. We know you have a great many choices when flying through dinosaur infested airspace, and we thank you for choosing Yoder Airways. 
Alright, well, that was a bit weird. That was a bit of a bug, I think, but never mind. I, I don't really mind too much. Where are we? Out. Oh, man. InGen's gonna be pissed when they get the bill for this. <laughs> and then they should have gotten pterodactyl insurance. Tyranodon insurance. Huh? Can you fix it? Uh, yeah. Give me about a month. A month? An hour. There's Not duct tape near a month. survival kit. All right, well, we're back on the ground then. <coughs> These jungles seem different. Different from what? All jungles kind of look the same to me. Hey, you remember the... Hey, <laughs> hold on. Is that compies? Sounds like compies. We are survivors. Maybe. But we're still pretty far away from where you spotted the fire. And whatever it was, it's gone now. Let's move out. Let's move out. And not get eaten. Smoke. Check it out. We're close. Come on. Hold up. It may not be safe. I know. That's what I have this for. That's not going to do anything if there's a T-Rex or a Velociraptor though there, is it? Looks like they've gone. Oscar, definitely signs of camp. The subjects were here. Just need to pick up their trail. Well, they were heading north, right? So we should be able to just head north. Uh, right. What do we have around here? Not the berries, that is for sure. Uh, what's this? The blood, right? I got some blood here. This just keeps getting better. So I'm guessing they went up this way. Lots of we got dinosaur some fresh stuff. Here, Oscar. I'm guessing dinos. Definitely dinos. Uh oh. Oh boy. I'll bet that's not gonna go over well with mom. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh! God! Oh god! Okay. Don't let it spit on you! Don't let it- oh no! I missed it! I missed the quick time event! Oof, okay, right. We're still good for now, we're still good for now. We need to get the hell out of here. Ooh. Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh, come on, game! Why are you giving me no time to react? God, the quick time events are so harsh! Thank you, buddy. You okay? Oscar, thank God! Oof. I thought I was a goner. I told you to be careful. I was. was that thing, anyway? Whatever it is, I'm gonna kill it. I feel kind of bad. Whoa, whoa, calm down, big guy. It's over. It's over. Let it go. Look at it. You won. It's not gonna hurt anyone now. I feel kind of hey, bad that we... Thanks. Anyway, I looked everywhere. Couldn't find any sign of a trail. That way. That sounds like somebody. I, I kind of feel bad that we wounded it like that. Like, obviously, it's it's not in you trouble, we're but... we straight towards a cliff? Don't you? There's no way down from here. We're gonna have to find another way around, which will take us, I don't know, at least a half a day. There's an old goat path that will take us down. Where? How do you know that? What's this? What the? Oh, wow. How can you tell me about any rides like this, Dan? Oh, yeah, they weren't up and running yet, were they? Bone Shaker. Uh, the rides aren't ready. Well, none of the rides are ready for the public. I, I didn't want to get your hopes up. That path was ancient. Carved into the stone. It survived storms, earthquakes. Look, it's it's too late to go around. And How does she know this? Go back the way we came. Just use the radio. Contact the rescue team. It is our best chance of survival. Down there. We can ride this contraption to get us down to that exit. We're gonna ride it? That lever. It looks like it would set the tracks to stop at that exit. Yes, but that's the emergency lever. Besides, it's obviously not ready for people to use. Yeah, this sounds like a bad idea. Like the only way. You find us a safe way down, or I'll throw you down. If I can get the power on, I might be able to set the, the ride to maintenance mode from up here. What's maintenance mode? It'll switch the tracks. Same as the emergency lever. Basically, it lets the employees use the tracks for work and repairs instead of for fun. But 
I don't see any cars on the main track, Dad. Get the power on. We're still going? Yeah, it's getting dark. We cannot go back the way we came, and it sounds like the dinosaurs are getting ready to hunt. Of course are they, they are. Hunting us? Probably, yes. Well, there's still a good ways off, but we shouldn't stick around here for long. Listen, if we're going to make it to the coast, we're going to have to work together to make it there alive. Understood? You, come with me. We're going to get some cars on the track. All right, cars on the track it is. Not sure how we're going to do that, but... Stand by the lever. We'll figure it out. You're going to help me get the cars on the track. So you keep saying. Hey, Dad, what are these cars for? They don't have any seats. My guess is those are utility carts. we got to get them off the track and load in some cars we can actually sit in. Huh, okay. Well, it shouldn't be too difficult, should it? Move the scaffolding. How am I supposed to do that? It's, like, way too heavy. Uh, is there a button we can press or anything? Maybe? Yeah, maybe we can. Ah. That's how they pick cars. So that's like the selector then. Get the cars onto the track in the right order. You can fit up to four cars on the track at once. Right, okay. So it's a puzzle, nice. Alright, so we want to... We, we kind of want to get... How, how many of the... Right, so how do we get a car off of the track? That's what I want to know. Can we... I don't, I don't really see a way to get a car off of the track. So one, two, three. <clears throat> Why do we need to get four on? Um, oh, we have other things we can do here as well. Interesting. Hey, these, these are the main controls for the roller coaster. I should be able to set it to maintenance mode from here. You would think so. But, guys, that is where we're going to leave it for this episode because we've got a bit of a puzzle to go here and I don't know how long it's going to take me to figure this one out. So, man, it's really heating up, isn't it? Uh, that was an interesting fight as well. I kind of felt bad for the way that he just kicked the dinosaur like that. I mean, it's, it's literally just doing what instinctively comes to it. So, I don't know. I, I kind of feel a bit bad about it, <laughs> even though it was trying to kill us, but whatever. So, as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. A big thank you to my patrons, Arcades Games, Wayne, Nate, Terminally Nerdy, and Paul from the Phantom Fellows for all the support. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed the video, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you all next time.